So I'm gonna give you guys a bit of a walkthrough with what is going on with this battery pack. Um, Russ has just finished taking it out of transportation mode. So it is pretty much ready to go in the car. I'm gonna show you what we have here. On the front, we have our cooling. On the front, we have cooling jackets on the battery pack. All across the top in this channel is our uh, BMS system. That is the main uh, fuse breaker. On the back here, we have a couple vents. These are all our communication ports. Those are the high voltage ports for the DC to DC, which takes the 800 volts and converts it to 14 volts. We also have the output for the AC compressor. And then the last one is for a battery heater, inline battery heater for those cold mornings when we need to bring the battery up to temperature before we can start using it. At the back, we have our another coolant outlet port. And then those are the big lines that go to the uh, charger, the charging port in the back of the car in the trunk. And then the two main battery lines that also go to the inverter to power the motor. Another neat feature about this pack is the bottom plate for the pack is also now an entire skid plate for the bottom of the car. So it turns pretty much the back, the whole bottom of the car into a flat bottom, which gives us great aerodynamics. Right here is about where the subframe is. So this juts up to go over the subframe, the steering rack, and the factory motor mounts uh, on the subframe will pick up these corners on both sides.